Bang! Neves Knives, I'm Jared, and here we have, we have three new CJRB Pyrites. This is the first one. This is gonna be a quick one. It's just a first impressions, but we have contoured titanium scales with a carbon fiber inlay. Inlay work is done very well. Titanium mill pocket clip that works extremely well. I think these clips are phenomenal. Then we have this beautiful Damascus, and it is, it's hard to pick up on the camera, but it has like a yellow tint over it with little purple specks. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. It almost looks wet or like it has polyurethane or something on it. The button lock action on the Pyrite is about as good as it gets for thumb stud action on a button lock. Very, very snappy, great size, very ergonomic for a slim, smaller to medium sized knife. This is a perfect size handle to get a full grip and squeeze on it comfortably. And you can still choke up. Very useful blade shape. Now, when we get to the next one, the next one is also titanium and contoured with the inlay, but it has S90V. So S90V steel, I do not know how they're heat treating it. This is only first impressions. I don't even know what HRC they're heat treating it to. Hopefully it's at least 62, but I, I, I have to confirm that and go check. But like I said, it's just a first impressions. Titanium milled pocket clip, again, super snappy action. Has a really cool sound too. Yeah, love the acoustics on it. Good access to the thumb studs too. Very satisfying to reverse flick. And then we have the third one, which is flat titanium scales. Now the flat titanium scales are just as ergonomic as the contoured one. So I don't think there's really a better or worse here. It's just slightly, slightly different. But most people would say probably contoured is a little bit more comfortable, but it's hard to argue because this thing's very comfortable in the hand. But we have the same Damascus as the black one. So we have this beautiful wet looking Damascus with the purple hues and titanium flat scales. Now here's the thing with this one though. We have a budget clip. I do not know what they were thinking. I don't know why they put this clip on here. Um, I almost feel like it was a mistake or something. I don't know. But why do the, the spring clip when you could do the milled clip on the titanium. I don't know why they did that. Now I will say that the titanium ones with the milled clip are not reversible, the contoured ones, the flat one is. So I don't know, I mean, I don't see why that would matter like of uh, reversing the pocket clip because you know, these ones are just reversed too. But I don't know. Um, anyways, I mean, it's a cool knife. I, I like the Pyrite quite a bit. I do think it's one of their better models of the year. Uh, my favorite model from CGRB is the Echo so far, but the Pyrite is, you know, it's an absolute beast. And it, it's something that I think most people uh, really like because not only is it a good looking, attractive knife, but it's a very useful design and a phenomenal size for most people. When you feel the Damascus, it's you don't feel any of the the you know the lines or the pattern. You don't feel that at all. It is literally like wet glass. It is super duper smooth. Uh, good geometry on these. These they're definitely going to be great cutters. And you know, as far as my experience goes with their Damascus, so far it's been great. I have had zero issues with their Damascus so far. So you know, time will tell if anything you know comes in the future. But as far as right now goes. Um, it's been good. It's been great. So um, it is a, a Damascus that a lot of the companies are using. It's the same Damascus, which seems to be a pretty good Damascus. I did see one edge retention test in the past and it did really, really well. So I'm not for sure if this is the exact same stuff, but you know, uh, hopefully it is. Like I said, this is just a first impressions. Everything will be linked down in the description for you guys. Until next time, peace.